I think this summer was obviously very, very hard. Um, a lot of, like a lot of terrible things happened, but I think this summer just opened our eyes to um, to the problem and racism is still um, among us and needs to be fought against actively and not passively. There was a big surge after the George Floyd death. With any big event, I feel like the excitement kind of dies down at some point, and I honestly feel like it really can't. It's you know the future of our country, the future of our lives, you know, our kids' lives, and making it bad to be racist is something that you know, needs to continue to be seen out all the way. I uh, just say it's not done. If you think something's wrong, if you think something's not right, if you think something's not being dealt with properly, if you think someone's lacking justice, I think just as a human being, it's, it's your job to say something, it's your job to step up. We're basketball players, but we're not just basketball players, like, we're social advocates, and when people say stuff like shut up and dribble, we're not gonna shut up and dribble. We're gonna talk about what matters to us and try to like show the world what should matter to them and what we think. I mean, people can say that, like keep sports with sports, politics politics, but the bottom line is like they clash. No matter how small you think it is, it will eventually get bigger and you never know who's watching. So speak up. It's not that hard to educate yourself, but the next step, the hardest part, is then doing something with it. Like, now you know all this stuff, what do you do next? How do you make a difference? And I think that that's what a lot of people struggle with. Being aware of your surroundings, like your friends, your family, like those are people that you have, like those close connections to. And I think your own beliefs and how you carry yourself as a person is like infectious amongst those close-knit groups. So I think if, if you're doing the right thing every day and you're educated and you're standing by those decisions, it's infectious, like I said. If you want to get involved, get involved. If you don't want to get involved, get involved. <laughs> Having conversations within the teams and within athletics is very good and very helpful, obviously. But I think it's even more important to like bring those conversations to your everyday life and outside of Northeastern and outside of your teammates. Bring it to your friends, to, to your family, to people. I feel like that that is going to bring change and those are like the, mo the little moments that, that, that can like Help, like help us get to the bigger picture.